Hey guys, what's up? Mike Shen over here, and today I'm going to show you how to install 4.4 on Galaxy S3 GDI9300. So, guys, first of all, to update to KitKat, you need three things. The first thing that you need is CyanogenMod 11 KitKat zip file, and the second thing you need is Google Apps, that is the G app. The third and last thing that you need is Clockwork Mod. And the main thing, the most important thing that you need is Galaxy S3 International Version i9300. So, the links to this, these files are in the description. You can download it from there. And I'm going to download Cyanogen Mod. So, go to get.cm and uh, click on check out the download page. Now search for your Galaxy S3, hit Ctrl F and type i9300. So here is your Galaxy S3 International. You can download the latest update that is a nightly. The stable version isn't out yet. So I'm going to download the nightly. Okay. So the second thing that you need is Google Apps. Just hit enter. There are Google Apps on wiki.cyanogenmod.org. So just download it via torrent. I'm going to download it via torrent. And add them. So I'll see you when the downloads are complete. So once you have downloaded the files, copy and paste them in your device using the USB cable. So here are the files that I just downloaded. I have to just copy them and paste them in my device I'm going to paste them on the external SD card just hit paste and let them copy now once you've copied the files to your device you have to go to the recovery mode to go to the recovery mode hold down the volume up key the power key and the home button all three together now I have installed Clockwork Recovery Mod and I have, a vi I have made a video previously so if you haven't checked it out check it over here and now in Clockwork Mod I have the touch version of Clockwork Mod so just click on install zip and choose zip from storage SD card now it will take some time to load up okay so now all these zip files are on the bottom as you can see I have a Cyanogen mod I have an older Cyanogen mod and I have the latest one so I'm going to install the latest Cyanogen mod 11 just click on it and it will ask for a confirmation just hit yes and your installation will start And make sure you have made a backup of all the data that you have. And I have installed Cyanogen mod previously so I don't need to make a full format of the device. Uh, but in your case if you have some other ROM you might need to format your device. So it says that the install is complete and to install the G app you have to go back to install zip and choose zip from SD card and go to the bottom and install the G apps but I have installed G apps before so I'm not going to install it just hit go back and reboot your system now let the device reboot as you can see there is the Cyanogen mod boot animation just give it some time to load up
now it will update all the apps so if you're installing it for the first time you might probably ask to choose your language your country write down your email address or sign into signage and mod account so but I have installed it previously so I'm not being asked it again so the Android is upgrading uh, wait for the process to complete and now the boot is complete and let me just show you the android version in settings in the about device you can see the android version is 4.4.4 it is the latest version of kitkat so guys enjoy with your android and hit subscribe and like if you like my video and just stay tuned for more amazing videos till then sayonara